guys, welcome back to Forza Horizon 4. It is spring season and spring season comes with some new rewards. So let's take a look at the rewards. We get a Foxhole Corsa. Well, and a legendary rabbit outfit. Well... Not two things people are really looking after, but why the hell wouldn't you get it? And by the way, we have almost gotten the crown fix, so that is still a goal. Let's see what else is new. We can win rabbit ears, a wheel spin, a super wheel spins, a modern race helmet in white, a hundred thousand credits and then the Lancia Delta so that is one expensive car so that is definitely worth getting as well so these are the things you can get this week in the festival playlist but let's of course not forget the Forceton shop so let's go to the Forceton shop Alright, what can we earn over here? Let's take a look at this shop. Alright, and the first thing we see is this Mercedes-Benz E63 AMG. And you might be thinking, why the hell would I buy this car? 700 points is quite a lot for an epic car. But there is one thing you most likely or probably, or uh, maybe some of you do know, but well... This car you can buy from the auto show. You can only get this car from a wheel spin, so this is actually quite a rare car. So that is definitely a nice car to get if you have the points. And then we have this legendary 2011 Kunisek Agera. Not the RS, just the normal one. And you might be thinking like... Hmm, is this a legendary car? Well, you can buy it from the auto show for I think 1.5 million credits. So here is 1.5 million credits worth 400,000 points. I don't know. Depends on how many points you have and how many credits. And for some more, what else can we buy? Some normal wheel spins, some super wheel spins. Ooh, and this is a nice looking jacket. And we get a monster energy cap. I don't know anything about fashion. So let's not do that. Alright. Now I think we have discussed what we can get this time. So I think it is now time to actually do some stuff. Let's see what do we need to do. Let's once again as always start off with the weekly challenges so what is new for us let's see we need to own an SUV sports utility hero vehicle well SUV is sports utility vehicle for those of you who don't know most likely everybody does but you never know all right 10 bin man skills nothing special we need to f win free cross-country circuit events and then we need to get 10 trading skills trading paint skills all right so do we need really need a class for this car that's the first thing i'm wondering i do not think so why the hell would we bring this up to s2 i think we can do this in s1 class Hmm, which one we would take? Well, let's take a new one because I want to tune a car. I am not sure. Should we choose the Earth Base? Should we use the Eurus? One of both. Or should we take the Volkswagen to wreck? Trading paint skills, uh, bin man skills, and freeway. So nothing special. Uh, which do I think is most cool? Well, the Euros is cool, but it's a Lamborghini, so I'd rather have the old one. The F base is kind of cool. I don't know. Something about this Volkswagen Touareg is is calling me to to pick me, pick me. 
I'm the most common one, but I can be awesome, so you have to pick me. All right. <coughs> Sorry for that, guys. Ooh, look at this. I like this blue color. Mm, let's go to the upgrades. Oh, I think we are done right now. So this is our VW Turek. It looks kind of funky with the front splitter and the rear wing. But it has a V12 in it because we wanted to get top of S1 class. Let's take a look. 928 kW. 1227 newton meters and that with 1989 kilos it goes quite fast it has a top speed of 8.7 which is quite high i think and 7.1 handling which is not great acceleration 8 which is in top of s1 class rather bad then 9.2 launch which is decent and on 6.8 braking which is Horrible, actually. Top of S1 class, you should have better braking than 6.8. So don't use this golf or racing on the road, I think. But I like the looks of it. Except the front splitter. Stupid. There we go. Let's buy this thing. Ooh, look at this. Yes, we want this. And we need this in our life. Why? Just because... No, I don't want to do it with the sound in background. Yeah, first chapter completed. Worked good looks. Oh, we already crashed. And there is a Forza form. But we are busy right now, Forza. This is a drift car. Nice. Nice. Alright, let's go to cars. It is time to tune this thing. And the gearing is awful, as you can see. Why are you not using all your gears? That's better. Ooh, do we want some camber? Yeah, please. Something like this. I don't know. Do we want it off-road? Let's quickly load the right height a little bit. I don't know how to tune this thing for off-roading. Let's just give us downforce. Our handling and braking is bad, so some downforce would rather be useful, I think. Yes. Alright, we have finish tuning our car we don't know how it tries but let's continue we need to get 10 bin man skills and now you might be wondering how do you get bin man skills well you hit bins and where is a better place to find bins than in a crowded city and we no longer have to wait we have arrived in edinburgh and it is time to get 10 bin man skills and was that a bin or not? No, doesn't look like. Where's my bin man skill? There's a bin. Yeah, that's our first bin man skill. And there's another one. Ooh, we missed a few. Where was my second bin man skill? Well, at least we got one. There's another one. Give me my bin man skills, game. Going for slow? No, I want bin man skills. There is another bin man skill. So if you are looking for an easy way to do this, just drive up and down this road on the sidewalk. And this is this SUV sounds so I don't know. It's not supposed to sound like this. It's more. It is a goddamn SUV. There is another bin man skill. I don't know how many we have right now, and we are missing all the bins. What? Why are our points gone? I don't know. Let's just continue. Oh, I want my V8. Then we can to hit top of S1 class. Sometimes you have to make hard decisions in life. Maybe this was the wrong decision. Everybody swaps in the V12s, but this sound is just so... I don't know, it doesn't fit the car. I'm probably annoyed by this, actually. <laughs> yeah, but at least we get another Binman skill. And we can drift this thing. Yeah. And that's another Binman skill for us. Come on. 
That's another burn mask girl. And this car is actually quite fast. Look at that. 150 kilometers an hour. 360. Yeah. Oh, give me that bit, man, skill. Boy! Oh, oh, but what's that? Who do want bin man skills? Where are the bins? Ah, there we go, and that is already 10. Good, the. Uh, what was it? Bucket? Something, something, kick. Completed. Let's see. Kick the bucket completed. Now for chapter three. We need to win three cross country circuit events. Alright, game. If you want us to do that, we will do that for some fun some points. Now. The only hard thing to do is to find which uh, one we will do. And it looks like this is a cross country circuit one. AI is actually nowhere to be seen right now. This this thing is oh, it's just properly quick actually. I'm so surprised by this. Nope, we didn't get it. Alright, but we still managed to not fuck up really bad. So that is first place. That is the third chapter completed. Now it is time to try and get the final chapter. That is bump and run. So we need to earn 10 training pain skills. So where are we going? Of course, we are heading to the town because it's always crowded in towns. All right. Time to get our trading pain skills. Let's see, can we find some people? Come oh, on, this is Edinburgh. Where are you guys? Wait, let's get on the other road. Ooh, the breaking his fingers properly bad. It is fast, it just. It, it goes, it is fast, it drifts, <laughs> it won't stop. Now you do have the speed and the top speed acceleration, but you can't stop. Alright, our first victim. Trading bait, that is one. One. Nope, that is not two. That is. More, where are more cars? We need some more friends to hit. Oh, watch out! What is he doing? Is that trading paint? Why is it not trading paint? Come on! He hit him! Give me my trading paint. Oh, why do we keep missing these people? That's a tree. I was not paying attention. Alright! See some more victims. Let's cut them off. Yeah, that's another one. Let's cut him off as well. Nope. That's another trading paint and another one that is four so far I've counted. Ah, uh, come on, get over here. Miss. Miss. Yeah, that's number five. We finally get a hit. I don't know if that was number six. That was. That's at least number six. Drip the swing. Yeah, let's get this one. Yeah, that's seven. And we see a next victim. On. Tough cookie completed, so that were 10 already. It didn't properly register all of them. But as you can see, all the chapters have been completed. We once again did it, guys. So, 
guys thanks for watching i hope you enjoyed it please like the video please like and subscribe i need followers nah kidding guys only if you want to i hope you have a great day guys and i hope you enjoyed the video i hope to see you in the next one so check you out later guys